And it's, 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 it's sad because there's just been been so many gun violence. An eight-year-old girl in Atlanta got killed. Mm-hmm. An eight-year-old kid at a Galleria Mall in Birmingham uh, oh, really? was killed. Uh, yeah, kids uh, caught up in, in the crossfire. And I, I, I wasn't going to even say nothing about this. I've been dealing with this all morning, sitting up here with butterflies in my stomach trying to do a show. You know, my, my youngest daughter was shot last night. Who? And she, Aaron. What? She, what? What? She in the hospital right no, now. Oh I, no, no, no. What? That's why I can't Aaron. have focus because I'm sitting up here trying to do the morning show and trying to book my flight Wait, to Houston Aaron to go and shot? see about her. She was shot. Uh, How's shot she doing? twice last night. She's oh, what? Dead. She's fine. Yeah, she's fine. It, it just, it just, I'm just so angry right now. <laughs> and and I, I just made the video about the eight year old kid and my daughter going to Waterburger to get something, something to eat last night. And you know, uh, uh, I go to bed around about eight thirty or nine o'clock, and I woke up text message. I, I got to do the show. I came trying to focus, trying to do the show, and trying to figure out because it ain't hardly any flights. Because of, because of COVID, they, you know, it's limited flights. So I got to, you know, fly to Dallas and then drive down to Houston because it was a seven-hour layover. But the fact that uh, she's, you know, laying up in the hospital and probably going to have to go into surgery. Oh, my stuff. God. She's just crying. She's crying. She's scared. I can't get to her. And I just I just uh, hate it. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, and, and all the stuff these people out here trying to do to fight for the rights of black people. This is no discredit to Black Lives Matter because I believe that and I'm with that move, movement 110%. And, and one has nothing to do with the other. But there are some criminals in our community that we need to do something about. They are out here, not just my daughter. Some kids didn't make it. That 8-year-old kid did not make it. I'm okay with my daughter. Yeah. She's going to be fine. But the eight, the two 8-year-old kids in Atlanta... The eight-year-old boy in 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 Birmingham, they got they mama got to go. I get the luxury of going to the hospital, even if they don't let me upstairs to see her waiting in the lobby, right? I get to wait in the lobby until the doctor comes down, and I get to text and talk to my daughter because I spoke to her this morning. She was crying and scared. But just think about all the parents. Forget me, forget me. Think about all the parents that got to go pick out a casket this morning. Lord Jesus. Yep. We bad, man. Mm-hmm. You can't. You get mad at us when the, uh, old old folks done retired. They done retired. They can't even sit on the front porch because of y'all ass. Can't Walking walk back and forth, cussing all loud, alley with your shorts and your underwear, showing no respect for authority. Will cuss an old person out? Ugh. I don't understand it. Mm-hmm. And I just pray. I'm sitting up here, a gunshot victim myself. And it has affected my, uh, 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 shot one of my kids. And I'm still up here fighting and, and, and praying uh, uh, for, for, for the rights of black people and all of the parents that had to bury their loved ones due to gun violence in our own community by our own people. It's absolutely disgusting. Oh, my God, Ricky. <laughs> yeah, so if I, you know... But, you, can but tell, it, it, you can tell that you're not all the way here. You can t- I could tell it was something on your yeah, skin. Yeah, you I you could can, tell, too. We could feel it because you, you, you've you been yeah. so quiet and stuff, and I'm like, something is going yeah. on, and I was going to call you after this. Oh, my God. She, yeah, oh, just, my I'm God. Just, just, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just so disgusted. sorry to hear uh, that. Because my daughter could have died. If that, if that, yes. if that was, she was shot with a hollow point bullet. Oh, if that bullet would have hit her in the chest, she would have been dead. Oh, God, Ricky. And I just, I just, I just hate it. I Tell just her hate we it. love her. Send her our love and we yeah. praying for her. Ugh, that's so but, senseless. Going to get a burger. That, that that just don't make no sense. These you, you, who Lord. So I, I, I just I just I just need everybody all over the country mm. and, and we all need to figure out what we're gonna do about things that's going on in our own community because those numbers are far worse than the than the ones that the police are doing. But I'm still with Black Lives Matter. I'm still with that movie and, and it and, and, and it it, it, you make it hard for, for people that's trying to do the right thing and trying to have rights for us. But look how we act and the things that we do to our own community. Us. You invalidate you all the think? efforts and yeah. make our Absolutely. make our efforts feel irrelevant. They don't care. Yeah. Absolutely. So I'm not going to even merge that argument just because because I'm, I'm with it. I'm still with it. I'm still going to march. I'm still going to protest. I still b- believe in, in everything that they're doing and what they stand for. 
but we got to, we got to have a whole nother conversation after we uh, get finished with, with this and get some of the things. And after this election, it got to be a real conversation because we get mad. And, and they always say you're talking down to black folks when you have to correct us. You're talking down to your people. You done made it big and you're talking down to people. And But we continue to take the bullets and get affected and get robbed and get your house broke in. And get and go through all of this stuff, but you can't say nothing, or you get canceled or dragged on the internet for talking down to black folks. When you are a victim of crimes from your own people, all the people in Chicago that got shot, all the parents that got to sit in the ER. Now I'm one of them got to sit in the ER uh, uh, down in the lobby because you can't go upstairs. I got to do that today. And a flight, a, a flight to Dallas and drive three and a half hours to Houston by myself. I don't care. I'm a man. But it's just what we got to do. We're just in the middle of a fight. So you're fighting us, and then you're fighting the police on the other end. So we're we, we going we gonna to keep it rolling. We're going to keep it moving. God is still good. God is still in the blessing business. And I don't care if you don't pray for nobody else. Don't worry about me. My daughter is fine. But please pray. But all of the parents whose kids was killed this weekend. More Rick and Smiley Morning Show coming up.